What is up guys? Jake here with the next Vainglory video and on a team, uh, actually a, a team, uh, what we have inside the guild, the teams on it, uh, with Whistle and Dwarf, a couple of guys that are on my team, playing with Taka, Catherine, and Celeste. And we played quite a few games tonight and this is just the one I happened to record and we were sort of, I don't know, we were batting about 500. It really wasn't that great. Uh, we're playing in about rain. I, I was, when I started this off tonight, I was uh, tier five gold. I think I actually dropped down to like tier five silver during this session. Uh, so we really weren't on, we really weren't, you know, wrecking people, but we had some good games and we had some bad games. So this was one, luckily I recorded one of the good games. Uh, we did pretty well this one. Uh, going up against Saul, uh, Kosh, Kashka, and Catherine, I believe. And just starting off with the normal stuff, our rotation farming. Trying to get our, our gold worked up and trying to get some levels. You know, again, I've, you guys have heard me say it a million times, but, uh, you know, this is, I guess you could call this my main, is Taka. And getting him to level six is so important. As quickly as you possibly can, uh, getting that ultimate, because until he can jump in and out of battle, uh, he doesn't really want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody in this match. So uh, that's what I'm after right now. And so in order to do that a little bit quicker, Catherine peels off and goes up in the lane with Celeste. And just sort of hangs out there, lets her contract build up some gold and, and protects her from Saul. Because Saul's a handful, especially early game. Uh, and, and a good one is a handful throughout the game. So uh, Celeste doing their best up there and Catherine helping out. And me just trying to rush level six. Right here I get in a bit of a skirmish. I catch him in my bushes and two on one. Uh, we are on Discord here. So that's the advantage of having Discord. Immediately they start coming down to help out. And we sort of turn the tides on them pretty quick because they're just not ready for it and boom get, get on Kashka start putting some heavy damage on her and she goes down real fast uh right here uh I was tapping I don't know how uh, Catherine got away there but wisely did but she, we would have had her as well uh but just could not get the hit on her for some reason grab my heavy steel and just get back to work we're going to get into their their jungle we know we sort of got the upper hand right here so I want to come in and make them pay for it a little bit, grab their backs, and then just sort of, I think we just grab a few of the rest of their stuff and head on. Don't want to fight too heavy at, you know, early mat, early game like this, but you see at three, almost four minutes, I'm already level four, uh, working on level five. So I'm getting there very quickly, and my gold's doing pretty well. Uh, so I, hopefully my build will be, you know, on on pace, if not just a little bit ahead, ahead of pace, uh, outpacing the, the enemy. And that's when you really, once you can do that, you can sort of snowball them. You just keep it going. It, it makes such a difference in the game. Uh, right here, they do get Celeste down, so we come up to help out. Uh, we take Saw out and just sort of clear the lane out of the way. Uh, not going to worry too much about Catherine. She's there. We just sort of run her off and make sure she's not, you know, beating on our on our turret. Saw puts so much pressure early game on turrets. It's just insane. It really is. Uh, you see how much damage he's already got on that turret, and uh, we've had two people up there half the match. So it's just the way it is with Saw early game. Uh, but because I know they're all over there, I'm going to come in. Uh, Catherine, you know, again, we're on Discord, tells me to come on down. We're going to invade their jungle one more time, take their backs. Uh, Kashka comes over and wants to try to stop us from doing it, try to last shot those uh, those backs. I think she actually did get one last shot and got out of there with her life. But I got level six, so I am happy and ready to start putting out some pretty heavy damage. Also, I've got, I believe, enough gold, maybe not quite, uh, for my Sorrow Blade. Once that goes out down... Uh, the match is going to be totally different, uh, and people are going to start dying really, really quick. So right here, we kind of get jumped on, uh, but I do manage to get out of there with my life. Saul comes down, uh, so we're sort of in trouble here, and I just barely, I have my boots, just barely escape, just a sliver of life left, and Catherine does take one for the team. Um, Celeste actually went down there, and it was just sort of bad timing, went down and actually died, but no big deal. We get back up and get back into the fight. So right there, uh, Saul is because Celeste goes down. We're gonna get up there, and there's no way to stop it. You know, it's already he's got a wave right in front of it. Uh, that turret is doomed. Right there, it goes down. Uh, but we're getting our jungle. We're getting our farm, and then yeah, as you see, my gold there, plenty of gold to grab that uh, sorrow blade. Uh, but before we do that, we're gonna grab Saul. He comes down into the jungle for some reason. Uh, big mistake. Takes a few shots, and Celeste finishes him off with that ultimate. Nice ultimate right there. Uh, and we've got Catherine hurt so bad, I thought, why not jump in, use the ultimate, take her out as well. Uh, just really trying to make them pay uh, for, you know, getting us last time, I guess. Uh, invading again to take their jungle. Uh, their backs were already cleared off right there. 
I think they might pop here. Yeah, right there. They pop just as we're about to leave. Uh, so go ahead and get that. I think that's three times we've gotten their back. So that's pretty big, you know, when you do that to, to your enemy. Uh, you're still in their farm. You're, you're starving them out of gold, uh, and you're getting the lead right there. So level seven, uh, still taking most of their jungle here. But they're on the gold mine. You get it taken down, but again, uh, we were invading and, and just didn't get back in time, and we decided just to make them pay for it. Once again, take out two of them. Uh, Catherine gets away because she's starting to get pretty tanky on her end. 3,000 gold. I've got to spend it here. So there, grab my Sorrow Blade, grab my Tier 2 Boots, and now just checking to see what they're doing. And they actually are pretty much all going uh, Crystal Power, I believe, in this match. So go ahead and grab some defense and start getting a little bit tanky. Uh, back to the farm here, just grabbing our, grabbing our minions, keeping them cleared keeping that gold in our pockets so we can outpace them. Uh, even though they've got us on a, on a turret right here, we're still at a pretty much at an advantage simply because of the farm. They did get that gold mine, which hurt a little bit, but right here at this point, uh, I'm putting out enough damage that Saul or Kashka, if they expose themselves, they're really going to be in trouble. And you see how, how far behind Saul is there. He gets several good shots on me, but just not much damage coming from him. Uh, right there, nice ultimate uh, get, gets... Uh, Kashka taken down. Catherine puts the, the herd on me here, chases me down, and I think maybe get them. No, I use my ability right here and just barely get away. A couple times there, I've just barely got away my life, and she presses too far, actually gets in front of that turret, uh, and with uh, Celeste there, go ahead and get the kill. And then right here, I thought we were going to get Saul taken down, but both of us were so low of life, uh, we just had to get out of there. Celeste actually takes the death there. Probably should have just peeled out like I did, uh, but probably want to try to protect that turret because again we're already down one turret and you see Saul putting heavy damage on that turret there but we're going to get in and take him out just before the turret goes down uh, so just doing our best to hold up and again we know we're beating them on the farm and we're actually beating them in team fights when it happens they're just pressing the lane a little bit harder uh, but we know that towards the end if we just continue to farm continue to get that gold get our builds up that it is going to pay off and that when when the time comes uh, we're going to be able to push through that lane pretty quickly uh, they're coming into the center here. Uh, Saw again pressing up and just uses that ability in time. I mean, I was on him, had my ultimate ready. He would have died very quickly, uh, but didn't get it done. Uh, just continuing on with defense side here, getting my tier two shield. Again, I think they're very, very heavy uh, crystal power on this one, if I remember right. Uh, take that gold mine from them right before it pays off 231. That was a good payout there for us. Uh, Saw is going to get our Catherine, and then Celeste is, is taking some damage right there. Uh, goes down and I almost go down, but I think I can get away right here. I've got my boots up. I've got my ability there uh, Just run off and that's three times this match that I've just narrowly escaped from my life uh, So right there Kashka comes in tries to do it I probably should have been falling back a little bit further here because look how much health um uh, Catherine's got there, but actually that dodge right there was pretty clutch. And then boom, they, my teammates come in. Uh, so Catherine gets the stun and the kill right there. Very, very nice. They do get the turret, however. Uh, so we are down two turrets at this point. I actually end up dying there. Should have just went back to the house, but I didn't. Got greedy. I go back to the store. Did I buy anything here? I'm not sure that I did. I think I'm just saving up for something. I'm not even sure what it was at this point because it's been a while since this match happened. But get back down to the farm again, trying to stay ahead on that gold. Uh, Celeste up in the, in the lane, just trying to keep keep Saul busy, not let him press forward much anymore. They're coming down a little bit here. I go ahead and grab my Aegis. Again, they just total, I think, Kashka and... Uh, I don't remember what Saul was. Anyways, they were heavy. They were heavy uh, crystal power this match. I do remember that. Uh, so right there, we put some good damage on Saul. He is almost dead. Going to get one more shot on him here, and boom. Catherine actually gets the kill, but then Catherine goes down. Uh, these two really aren't putting out much damage at this point, especially with Kashka being uh, crystal power and me having that Aegis. Uh, I can pretty much just get away from him when I want to with my ability, which is what I do. I put a little damage on him and just fall back and wait for my team to get back up. So from here, I decide I'm going to try to, try to grab a monocle. They None of them had any type of armor, uh, you know, on them. So I was just going to, I wasn't going to go like Aftershock or something along those lines. I just thought, screw it. I'll just go straight weapon power. Uh, keep, keep it up and see what they can do. Kashka takes off very wisely. She was done for. So Saul comes down and that is a mistake on his part. My ultimate comes back up right here. Going to put some heavy damage on him. Boom, boom. Nice ultimate by Catherine. And that is going to be that for Saul. He tries to escape, uh, tries to use in boots, but it is not fast enough. Boom. He goes down. 
Uh, now Catherine's all on her own. <laughs> so whistle. That was kind of funny. He was grappling because he missed a lot of stuns this this match. Uh, he, he's good with Celeste. Don't get me wrong. It's just he's it's not his main character. So understandable. I'm not very good on my uh, on my secondary uh, characters that I like to play sometimes. And he was missing a few stuns right there. So she gets away because of that. Does get that stun off and drops one in on there. Then I come in and get a shot. And I think right there she barely gets away. No, she comes back. I think. And for some reason, wants to die. I'm not sure why. Uh, take her down with that ultimate. And that is that. Saul's back up. So no need to press that turret. He's going to protect it. Uh, try to call back. But Koshka comes running in. But she's not going to. She's not going to catch me. I go ahead and get back and get back to the shop. Go ahead and grab my lucky strike. A little bit of power. Just get back into the fight here. Grooving back up with my team. They, I think, are on the Kraken right here. Or that we thought they were going to be. Saul comes in and uses that V ability at the wrong time. Get two or three easy shots off on him, and Celeste finishes him off. And then, boom, some beautiful stunning on Kashka, and she goes down. So now it's just us. We decide to go ahead and grab that Kraken uh, because all that's there is Catherine, and she's not going to be much of a threat. I mean, she can be an annoyance here. Uh, Celeste was going off and getting the, I believe, the minion mine, clearing the lane a little bit. And right here, we probably wasted a little bit too much time, took too long to take this down because at this point, Saul's back in the fight. Uh, Catherine's here, and now that it actually is a fight for who's going to get the Kraken. Uh, but right here, I believe we get it taken down. Yep, just in time. Uh, grab it, take it down. But we actually pay for it with our lives. Uh, again, probably not the wisest thing to take that long to kill the Kraken, especially early game like this. You know, they're back up so quickly. Uh, where are we at here on time? 16 minutes. That's a very, very early Kraken. Uh, but it does come out and take away that first turret, which is really all we needed out of it. It wasn't the greatest Kraken in the world, but they actually had a turret from their minions, so that stunk, uh, you know, but it, it, it did get that first turret out of the way, which is sort of the hardest one to get. You know, they're right there by the bushes. They can protect it the easiest, uh, so it's out of the way. Come down to the jungle, get another team fight here, jump on Koshka real quick. She goes down from that ultimate, and then boom, right onto Saul, and just a few stutter steps, and he is pretty much done with. So now I had to get out of there, uh, but, you know, Catherine chasing me, nice dodge of her stun there, and then they take her down, I think, or they get really close to it. But pretty much we won that, you know, obviously won that team fight. I uh, caught that scout trap. It seemed like I was running into a lot of scout traps, not necessarily in this match, but just tonight in general. They were really getting on my nerves. I think probably contraption needs to be nerfed a little bit. Not not bad, but, you know, it needs to be nerfed a little bit. There's When someone gets it and, and does it constantly, there seems like there's just scout lines everywhere uh grab my tyrants tyrants monocle and i think i'm pretty much at full build here if not i'm close um they come up i didn't realize that the, that they had taken out my teammates there uh and pretty much just chased me down and almost i mean look how close this was here uh just a sliver sliver of life left and that would have been big because it would have been a nice and i wouldn't be able to protect the base so glad that didn't go that way but my team's up pretty quickly afterwards and here we are pushing back into the fight uh, right here, go ahead, and I got stunned. Just a perfect stun there by uh, Catherine. It actually wasted my ultimate. Uh, Saul's in for the fight. So I'll fall back a little bit. Nice ultimate there by our Celeste. Uh, jump onto Saul, take him out, and then you can see how low of life um, Koshka is. Going to chase him down with my boots, put a few hits in, and take it out. And then it's just Catherine left. She's not going to kill me. You know, she can take a beating for days, but she's probably not going to take me down. Uh, we chase her down. I don't know what, I guess she used her, uh, I don't even know what it's called there, her, uh, one of her clickables on that stun, which is very, very good. That Catherine was actually pretty good. Uh, that was pretty good timing, reflex block or whatever, to take that out. So she stays a little bit too long here, though. I mean, I'm putting out a lot of damage at this point. So just beating on her, beating on her. In fact, if I just stuck with it right there, probably would have got the kill. But I thought, okay, let's fall back. Let's get, you know, we, we took their jungle. We've pushed them back. We've got pretty much caught up on turrets they're still ahead a couple of turrets uh, but we definitely have the advantage right here so don't want to lose it on a stupid mistake pressing too hard so grab a little bit of farm and waiting for them i think we're just going to try to ambush them a little bit here we know they've got to make the move we can sort of wait uh nice ult ultimate there she probably would have died in that position had she not used it but not much we could do so she just walks off after that but won't have it up for the next team fight so that's good uh, wait, just sort of waiting here, uh, waiting to see who's going to make the first mistake, do a little bit of scouting, 
Uh, she comes in with a stun, and then boom, right there. We see him in the bushes, jump on him. Look at the amount of damage. Celeste with that beautiful ultimate, ultimate after I had burst down, saw, gets the kill right there. Kashka goes down. I get that one, and then Catherine has no choice but to take off. So we are just taking out their damage so quickly that all that every time we do it, all that's left is Catherine. She's very hard to take down. You know, she's got that bubble. Uh, we're fighting her off, doing our best, but... Uh, just cannot quite burst her down when she does that. So this side we're going to go ahead and take this uh, Kraken. Just go ahead and beat on it a little bit. Uh, pull it right over in the bushes so they can't, she can't surprise us. We know we're going to see her coming. No big deal there. She tries to wrap it back around. And we probably should have killed her here. Uh, but we just thought, well, we won't worry too much about it. And she gets the last hit. Uh, very frustrating. <laughs> we kind of were laughing even though we knew it, it wasn't going to be that big deal. It was just like, man, you know. That was, that was our crack, and she slips in and gets it. So we're kind of frustrated with it, but uh, come down, put a little bit of a beating on her. I think she peels off here. We might actually get the kill. She, yeah, she stays a little too long here, and finally we get the kill just to, as a payback for stealing our crack. And then come up and take the crack. The crack doesn't even take a, a turret. You know, it has to go all the way into our base. Long way, Celeste is beating on it the entire time, uh, and we are just take it down. It gets like a one swipe off. Uh, on our turret and that's it it's down so not a good cracking for them but i guess it definitely is better than uh, the alternative which would have been us having it and marching into their base so from here i'm wanting to get an eve harvest just because uh, i think i think it'll help me a little bit in these fights a little bit of burst damage a little bit of uh, life steal so right there you see saw taking off uh, he should have never stopped running he goes down and then again kashka we just putting so much damage on him look at that boom goes down uh, Celeste and Catherine get those kills, but no big deal. Uh, looking at my kills right now, doing pretty good. 12, 2, and 14 assists. That's a lot of assists for a, a game with Taka. Uh, right there, I come down trying to get their minion mine, but Catherine's waiting, so I don't really want to fight Catherine and the minion mine at the same time. I fall back, wait for a little bit of reinforcements here. Celeste comes down to help me out. Uh, we get right back on that minion mine. Uh, Catherine does come out, gets a hit on me, stuns me. We do go ahead and take the minion mine and then put some damage on her. Again, more scout traps uh, right there. Another stun, keeping her keeping her basically off of us. She's had to retreat back to her turret. So we decided from there, at least I did, to go ahead and just grab their, their minions, get their gold, try to keep them starved out as much as possible, and then just fall back in, go to the, to the store. Again, build back up to 1,700. So we're getting a lot of gold. We're farming them basically on kills. We're farming uh, their, their minions, taking it from them. And then right here, Kashka back up. Why she wants to fight us uh, without their, their tank there, not sure. Take her out pretty quick. Saul keeps push, pressing forward. He's got uh, Catherine there, but not going to be enough. Again, Celeste with a beautiful ultimate. Takes it out, uh, and then Catherine is all on her own. I think she's probably getting frustrated at this point because she seems like she's always all on her own, and I think we get this kill here. I can't remember if we finally just say forget about it. We'll go get the Kraken or what we do. Get the stun there. A couple more hits. Now I think we actually do kill her here. She's trying like crazy to get to that turret. Boom. She goes down. Uh, again, that was just sort of a not going to let her get away moment. And this I just, since we're right there, we've got the wave. Go ahead and push this turret and try to push one more. Uh, but again, we're, you know, 26 minutes. It's starting to get a little bit late, but they're already coming back up here. Uh, they do go ahead and finish that turret off, and I decide to go down and just get set up, take out some of their some of their minions. We want to sort of ambush them as they try to push out here because we know they won't all be up because Catherine was killed late. So it's just going to be Saul and Kashka, and we know how quickly we can take those two down. Uh, so wisely, they fall back. They don't want to press too far and get in trouble. We know the game is pretty much over at this point unless we make a major screw-up. I told the guys here, I said, I've got you know 3,000 gold. I need to get to the store anyway. So let's just fall back, get to the store, do our thing, and then go from there. So from there, I go ahead and grab my Eve and my Tier 3 boots. And so at this point, I'm full build. Nothing more to buy, really. Uh, they do come down. It's just Catherine, though, so we really didn't want to engage just her. We know the other two were still dead. Uh, no sense just wasting time beating on her. Actually, the other two weren't still dead, but they were behind. Uh, they catch us a little bit off guard right here. This was the one time we screwed up. We didn't have any vision in that bush. We walked right into it. At least I did. Uh, nice ultimate again by Celeste, though. Uh, get a few shots on Kashka, and then boom, she jumps on me and takes me out. So that was a mistake. Should not have died there, but I did. Uh, so now it's just the three on two, but they are very low life. Uh, so right there, Catherine gets the kill on Saul. Uh, Celeste gets the kill, I believe, right here on Kashka. Does she get away? I don't think so. I think she gets the kill right here. Boom, yep. Uh, takes her out. Catherine actually gets that kill as well. And then it's just Catherine left again by herself. And she's low life. She's got to peel off. And I think 
they decide right here to go for the for the Kraken to not mess with that. Uh, Celeste goes down, grabs the minion mine just on the way through. Uh, no, oh, this, oh, sorry, I forgot this one. This, they don't go for the Kraken. This is a beautiful kill right here. Watch this. Uses that ultimate. Uh, and I, don't, I mean, she is right there at the front steps. Oh, gets the stun off. I mean, she is touching the line. Gets the stun off and gets the kill. And that is the game. That fresh wave coming in. Too much time. I'm not up in seven seconds. But all they've got to do, take out those turrets and get the kill uh, on the vein. And that is that. So, good match for us. Again, we didn't have the best night. Didn't have the worst night. I did drop some ELO uh, down into Tier 5 Silver. But hopefully can build that back up. I was really close to Tier 6. And then just, you know, Caught some bad luck. Some bad games didn't happen. I'm having trouble uh, playing this game as much as I would actually like to. It just seems like whenever I try to add a second game to my schedule, it gets very hard at times. Sometimes I have time. Sometimes I don't. I will do my best to keep these coming for you guys, though, because I do enjoy it. There's the, the score. Uh, there's the stats. Give everybody a thumbs up on this one. Uh, 12, 3, and 17. So not bad. Should have had more kills, but oh well. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Until next time, Jake, doing my best to help you guys suck less.